What's up guys, Steph here. Hello, hello, I haven't vlogged in forever. Um, a few things just to really quick. One, I haven't vlogged forever and I'm not committing to vlogging consistently. I just miss vlogging and I miss having those videos that I get to look back on and watch and it's really sad and it makes me sad. Um, the second reason I kind of stopped vlogging is because my vlog camera is kind of janky. It's been a little bit janky and it, it it got more janky. So I'm vlogging on my phone right now. Um, I think that's probably what I'm going to be doing just moving forward for a while um, unless this becomes like a thing again. But yeah, um, I wanted to just like check in with you guys and say hello and I miss you guys and I miss being able to because I'm not live streaming consistently I miss being able to like connect with you guys on a personal level more consistently so I thought I would try vlogging again one of the things is I'm hoping that these vlogs will be shorter so not 30 minute vlogs not even necessarily 10 minute vlogs just whenever I have something that I want to show you so I have a few things I want to show you first of all my house is a mess as you guys know, Chris and Soren and Jackson and Maverick, they were living with me. They moved out because they got their own house, but I rearranged my furniture. I'm actually going to spend today cleaning everything up because it's been getting out of control. Um, before, I don't know if you guys remember, the TV was actually over there. The table was over there and the sofa was like right here. So I switched the furniture around. I got this new TV stand. I don't know. I think I showed you guys. I actually got a new TV because the TV down here was uh, Chris and Soren's. I got this TV, super cheap. It's a dirt cheap. It's the TCL. You can get it on Amazon. This is a 55 inch for 200 and it was like 250. It was super cheap. Um, I also got this stand for about $70 and it has wheels. Um, this is so that I can turn the TV to face the kitchen if I want. That's That was the biggest reason that I didn't want to rearrange my furniture is because usually the TV is supposed to go here, but I want it to be able to have, like, see the TV from the kitchen. So this gives me the option, and I actually have used it where I've rolled it and turned it while I'm doing dishes and stuff. So I'm going to spend today cleaning and just kind of organizing. Mac is doing really well. I have to give him his eardrops. Um, I haven't really, there he is. He's, he, likes to, he likes to chill on the stairs, or I also have his little area over here where he has a cat tower to open the window and he'll like lay and sleep there. Uh, Mac got his checkup last week. He did blood tests. They gave him the senior blood test because he's old. Those pass with flying colors. He has a mild ear infection. So I'm having to give him ear drops twice a day. There's like, it's like three to four drops twice a day for 14 days. He hates it. So I have to do that because I'm a little bit late today. And then Wednesday, he has an appointment to get his teeth cleaned, which they didn't want to do it on Friday when he had his last appointment because they wanted to make sure that his blood test came back like clean. And they did. So he's going to get his teeth cleaned on Wednesday. He's going to hate that. The other thing that I'm looking at, I feel like he's a little bit sad now that Chris and Son and all of them moved out. So after he gets his teeth clean and however that goes, if it goes well, then I think I might, I've been looking potentially at getting um like a another cat i haven't decided if i want to get like a kitten or a, just a young cat or an old cat i don't know how well he would do with an older cat i'm not really quite sure so and i feel like if i get a kitten or a young cat i should get two because mac is um 14 now and what i wouldn't want to happen is like a vicious cycle which is what happened with mac and all the other cats is like if Mac leaves us, then I just have one cat by themselves and then I have to get another cat. So it's like, I might as well just get two cats together. So I'm not quite sure yet what I'm gonna do, but I just wanted to kind of keep you guys in the loop. So I'm gonna go ahead, give Mac his eardrops and then do some cleaning. I'll show you guys what that looks like afterwards. And yeah, one last thing uh, during this whole COVID time, I should have vlogged earlier in the COVID time because it would make sense, right? Um, I have been catching up on all my TV shows. I caught up, uh, I rewatched the entire series of Nurse Jackie. I have watched tons of things on Netflix, Dead to Me, Never Have I Ever. Um, I caught up with How to Get Away with Murder and I'm about, I'm trying to catch up with Grey's Anatomy. I was like 20 episodes behind. So um, one of the things that I realized today that I'm really excited about is that the episode that I'm on, which is the Alex Karev goodbye episode, I think, it seems like that's what it is. It's like when he's closing his chapter. Um, they finally got the whole Smart Resume, finally, like during that time frame. And Smart Resume is an Xfinity thing where you can just click the fast forward button and it automatically stops when the uh, 
when the commercials are done, which is super exciting. Okay, I just wanted to tell you guys that because it was really exciting for me. I have to wear the sunglasses because the first day I did, did this, I put the drops in his ears and then he shook his head and then the drop flew into my eyeball and it burned and I had to flush my eye out. And so now I wear protective eyewear. I'm also excited to vlog again so I can show you some of these things that I never get to show you in my real life. Um, I don't know if I ever showed you guys my lemon tree that my mom got me a long time ago, but it's doing really well. I want to show it to you guys. Okay, so look at this bad boy. It's doing pretty well. I can tell that some of the leaves up top are getting, I think, eaten by some bugs. I'm going to have to maybe pull it out a little bit. Um, it rained last night, so the ground's all wet. I've got one, one little lemon. There's a few other ones, but the other ones seem to have kind of died. The flower buds kind of all fell off, and um, I don't think it's season right now, to be honest. I think they're supposed to go in the winter, but that's okay. In this big pot, I have some green onion stems that I planted. Um, one of them didn't make it, but yeah, like I just put the root in the grass or in the ground and then it bloomed. And then these are two garlic cloves. So that's cool. And then Chris and Soren gave me this lavender plant. I'm waiting for a bigger pot to come because it looks, I think it's too squished. And so I need to transplant it, but I don't have a pot right now. I feel like I have so much to tell you guys. Jeez. Um, a few things. I've been addicted to home delivery, Costco. Target, Safeway, using Instacart or whatever it is that they use. Um, it's been really convenient and nice that I don't have to actually leave the house because I'm trying not to leave the house if I can avoid it. Um, and on Amazon, it's coming in on Wednesday, but I got a composter. So it's like, I have a green bin, but I got a tumbler, a tumbler composter because I've always... At work, we had a compost thing that we had created and I've always wanted to try one on my own. So I got a small one for here um, because I do want to start not planting a lot of things, but having a few different plants. And so I thought that'd be kind of fun. So when that stuff comes in, I'll definitely share that experience with you guys. Okay, guys, my day isn't going as planned. I don't know what's happening, but I haven't cleaned. It's still a hot mess in here. I did bake, which I hate baking. It's the bane of my existence. Look, I'm making blueberry muffins. I'm doing the It's Judy's Life recipe that she posted from some other website. Let me show you. Oh, my oven's dirty. Um, so yeah, I'm trying to bake these blueberry muffins, which lit literally, it was like a hot mess. I, It just was a complete disaster. I literally hate baking. I really dislike baking. It's because I'm not good at it. There's something about the fact that you have to measure everything and everything has to be perfect for it to work out. Oops, sorry. I just don't like that. Um, I'm actually cooking some. Chris yesterday gave me, she made a bunch of turkey meatloafs and she gave me a leftover one, which was really exciting. So I'm cooking that right now in the microwave. And I just had a quick FaceTime call with Dana and Maddie. They needed some help with um, like logging into one of their homework websites. And uh, I'm, yeah, so I'm gonna sit here and I'm gonna eat my turkey meatloaf and I'm going to finish watching some Grey's Anatomy. I'm still on episode like 16 and there's like 20 episodes. So I still have a little bit longer to go. Um, hopefully these muffin things turn out okay. <laughs> I'm not quite sure what's gonna happen with that. And I didn't film a video today, so I might try to film a quickie video. It probably won't be out until late this afternoon though. So whatever. All right, I just wanted to check in with you guys. Thank you, Chris, for the leftover turkey meatloaf. Okay, there's about a minute left, but I'm gonna take these small ones out because, wow, they look actually like okay. A little bit dark. Those are the big ones. Oh, wow, look at me, Baker Extraordinaire. Okay, I'm gonna do the toothpick test. Clean, clean. Mm, kind of clean. That's clean, yeah? Look at me, you guys, look at me! That was so difficult, I hate baking, but I'm proud of myself, and I'm excited to be able to share these with Chris and Dana and all them. Oh, 
And then we'll see how these big ones come up. There's 15 seconds left, we'll see. Okay, I did the toothpick test, they all worked. I did sprinkle a little bit of regular sugar on top of all of these, because that's what the recipe said, but these ones definitely got more than the little ones. Some of these got a little bit extra toasted on the top, but that's okay. These ones look good though, look at me, baker extraordinaire, yes. You guys, my muffins are really good. I'm really excited. I should have filled myself eating them. I ate two, I ate some of the darker colored ones because just in case, I didn't know if they were like burnt. I'm pretty, I'm so proud. Mm. They were good. Those were good. I'm excited. Hello guys, it's a new day. What day is today? The 19th, it's Tuesday. Um, I worked all day. I'm watching Burnt because it's one of my favorite movies. And look at this. Look at this. Wait, let me show you better. I'm going to flip my camera. My composting tumbler came in. I just built it. It kind of took not a lot of time, but a little time. So I'm going to start trying to make my own compost. I got some compost starter. I have some soil outside and I've been collecting my brown waste and I got to get some more green waste. But yeah, I'm excited to be able to kind of compost at home. We'll see how this goes. This is a small one because I didn't want anything fancy right now since this is my first time. But I'm excited to see if I can get some legitimate compost going. You guys, it's Wednesday. I hate this. I have to take Mac back to the vet. He's getting his teeth cleaned, but he hates being in his carrier. He hates the vet. He hates everything about this. So, ugh. Mac, it's going to be okay. All right, bud? We're just going to go to the vet one day in and out, and then you'll be good to go. I promise you. I guess I can't really make that promise, but I'll try. Okay. All right, Mac. You're okay, bud. Literally one of the worst things in the world is trying to drive in a car with Mac. He's so loud. It's it's so sad and it's just, it's loud. He's very loud. He absolutely hates his carrier. Mac is back in action. No teeth extracted. They want me to brush his teeth, which is what they told me last time, but it's very difficult. He did really well and it was cheaper than it was supposed to be originally. Hi, buddy. Hi. Hi, okay, let's go home, bud, let's go home. We are home. I'm about to take this bandage off of Mac, but I wanted to show it to you guys, because look how cute he looks. Look at that, he's a cutie. He's angry, but he's still cute. Good job, buddy, you did well. Oh my God, I, I was like in the middle of a nap and the mom called because she, they, they, she came and brought me food. I'm very excited. Oh, Mac is doing really well, guys. He's still a little bit angry, but you know, he'll get over it. He's uh, hanging out over here. Hi, bud. How are you feeling? Oh, he's gonna hate it when I have to put his eardrops in tonight. We did skip it this morning though, huh? Yeah? You look good, huh? It was funny because all my friends were like, why didn't you get pet insurance? And I was like, I, it just didn't seem worth it to me. And then I looked it up and then every place that I went to, they were like, Max, you know, he's too old. You can't get pet insurance. I was like, oh. Um, oh, you guys, I've actually been looking. I think I've talked about this on videos. I've been looking at adopting. Um, honestly, I've been looking at adopting two cats. I want to try to get a sibling, like a pair, because I think Mac... It's been good that I've been home, but I am getting ready to go back to work pretty soon. And with Chris and Sor not living in the house anymore, there's just nobody around. And I feel like he's kind of lonely. And I just think it'd be fun, not maybe, I don't know if he would love it, but to just have other animals around. He would probably boss them around, but just like for him to be around other moving things, because this is a really big house and for him to be alone all day, it just kind of sucks. So. I've been looking and we'll see how that goes. My mom is so funny. She made ma pao tofu, ma pao, ma pao tofu. And she put it in this like to go container. I bet you she saved that from somewhere. She did make me some rice and veggies. I already ate the veggies. I don't really eat rice to be honest. I can just eat this by itself, but it looks delicious and it smells really good. And they brought me a bunch of fruits cause I don't really eat a lot of fruits. So they brought me some bananas, oranges and mangoes and some onions cause I like onions. And look at my new indoor compost bin. I actually got this before I bought my own compost er thing, which I haven't started yet. The problem with it is that I can't compost meat or dairy products like I normally do. So this is gonna live in the kitchen. This is gonna have stuff that I can't necessarily put in my own compost bin. And right now I have my old bin with the things like I have old banana peels and things like that. 
that I'm gonna put in. And look, I made my brown waist and I included my dryer lint because you can include that. Okay. I feel like this vlog was all over the place, but that's how it's going to be because that's just how I live my life. Um, I just wanted to be able to vlog a little bit because I miss you guys. And uh, yeah, so I hope you enjoyed this vlog. I'm going to end it here. I'll try to do, I'm not going to vlog daily or anything, but I'm just going to kind of vlog as I go. I just, I'm going to go with the flow. It's my new life motto. Go with the flow. I'm just going to go with it whenever I'm feeling it. So um, I'll keep you guys updated on my cat adventures if I'm able to get a new one um new one or two I don't know we'll see um but I hope you guys have a great day thank you so much for watching and I will see you guys next time bye